Hey, hey, how you doing? It's Kawan Mayo, online entrepreneur, six-figure earner, top affiliate royalty. And it's huge news that I have to share with you guys. Like, it's just, <laughs> it's amazing because if you've been following me, if you have been following me, then this might not make as much sense. But if you have been following me and you know that, you know, you've been watching me for the past year with royalty, then you know you've seen everything up. The ups, the downs, the highs, the lows, the, the the drama, the stress, the blessings, the stressings, the everything. Like, you've seen it all. You know, the good, the bad, and the ugly, you've seen it all. And I said it from way back then. I said, man, you know, you need to show some loyalty, first and foremost, you know. And second, you know, just ride with the winning team because guess what? At the end of the day, proof's in the pudding. And the way that they was conducting themselves the whole time, which I'm talking about royalty, the way royalty been conducting themselves, it's been nothing but positive, you know. Yeah, you know, it had always been positive results, but it's always been positive in the way that they dealt with the affiliates, they dealt with their employees, they dealt with their customers, and that's what I paid attention from. To, paid attention to from day one. It never hit from anything. If it was an issue, they addressed it head on, you know, webinar right away. So it brings us to now, full year. You know, I said last year, 2018, it will not be about beacons. Didn't I say that? Everyone else was rushing to be the best beacon company, get into all this little nonsense that was going back and forth, companies fighting and people coming up with your do-it-yourself models. And it was just nonsense out there. Everybody wanted to come pop up overnight because they saw there was money in this field for sure, you see. But it wasn't meant for everybody to be in it. And I'm glad that Google took away the nearby because now it can go back to how it should be where people, the, the company that started this, you know, can go back and, and and take hold of and take it by the rings and go back to innovating brand new products and being first like we always are, you know, to bring things to the field and do things in a whole different way. So what I mean, what, I, what I'm getting to is now beacons are no longer going to function in the manner that beacons functioned in. All right. It had just been announced. And I don't know if you looked at my other videos that I've been putting up lately about royalty, but it's just been announced that now when our beacon is getting a proximity, when you get a proximity of our beacon now, 100 yards of that gym. All right. Now what's going to happen It's going to trigger hyper ads, real ads. OK, within over a million different, you know, it's over a million different apps out there in networks. We're starting off on the top, you know, some of the top 10. You know what I mean? Top 100, just to start off with. Already, I can tell you that we're already going to be in CNN, okay? Yahoo, AOL, Forbes, and Facebook. CNN is one of the high, is, is one of the um, most popular news uh, places that people go to for news. So that's a high end app for people to be in to see your message. Forbes, nothing to talk about there. Yahoo. Second, the only thing close to Yahoo is Bing. I mean, uh, is a uh, uh, is a uh, Google, and so Yahoo comes in second. And in Facebook, ninety percent of the people that you're gonna see out here on their app is going to be on Facebook. <laughs> you know, when you see them, say, "I bet what you doing? I bet you just see ten people. Eight out of those ten people, if out of the ones that's on apps, if you go find ten people that that's on their phone messing with some app." Out and about, I bet you to get ask them. I bet you eight out of those ten is probably on Facebook. You know, so to know that now when your beacon gets triggered, it's going to be an ad that someone's physically seeing as they on their phone, not hoping that they pull down their notification window, not downloading the app. Come on, guys, I want this to sink in. Like I know, you know, some companies are trying to scramble and they want to save themselves, so they're going to do anything they can, you know, to to, to still keep a foothold within the space but let's be honest would you i'm gonna let's just you know i always say we can lie to, to the world but you can't lie to yourself so ask yourself would you download an app okay in order for someone to spam you or to advertise to you what would be would you do that would you even do it with your favorite places that you already frequent let's even say that they say okay well we're giving uh, a tangible uh, stuff we make it we're giving value okay you went to go out and eat. You went to your favorite restaurant. Hmm, that steak was good. Hmm, that fish was good. Whatever you went to, it was good. After you're done with that, in turn, the restaurant said, hey, would you please download our app so that we can market to you and we can send you advertisements and we can promote to you? Would you please do that? 
Would you in turn say, hey, absolutely, and then be rushing to get to, to download that app? Would you really? After you just bought, purchased a brand new pair of shoes from Foot Locker, Foot Locker said, hey, please download our app so we can send a bunch of sneakers in your inbox. And, or we can send you know you a bunch of notifications of popping up every time some new shoes come in the store. They'll pop up on your phone. Even though you love Foot Locker because you just bought these shoes, how many of you would really download that app? I bet you it's a, it's, a, it's a larger percentage of people that wouldn't download that than that would. And these are places that you like and love. So let me ask you a question. Why would you download an app of some, from somebody that you don't even know? That you don't even know. You just meet them for the first time. Hey, how you doing? My name's Kawan. Hey, we talk, blah, 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 blah. you like, why don't you download my app so I can advertise to you, market to you, play with you. Don't we do that on Facebook already? Why well, need that for you to do that? And let's be honest. If I just met you and we're talking and we're to the point that I'm having you download my app, can't I just forget that? Shake your hand, meet a friend. Hey, how you doing? My name's Kawan. Can't I just do that? So it just, I don't know. I'm sorry. For me, it just doesn't make any sense. Like that just that business model does not make sense. And then, you know, so I'm saying they're not even gonna go the marketing route no more. So now our platform, if your if your platform is not for marketing, what's the sole purpose to be in this space? What are we selling customers on? An experience? How did well that go with Google Plus? You know, some of these other companies that tried it before, they even that platforms that paid you to go over there and post and they people they still couldn't take them off Facebook you're not gonna take people off Facebook so you're not gonna take people off Facebook to come over here to play in a local app I don't know maybe I'm wrong we'll see time will tell but what I do know is royalty took the smarter route and the smarter route is taking advantage of what we already know works we know Facebook ad works we know that it's it's beneficial to pop up in relevant places that you know people are already on we know it's beneficial to make people not have to jump through no steps which means no longer will they have to pull down the notification window to see. No longer will they have to put on Bluetooth and nearby notifications to, in order to get our message. No longer will they be subject to just see a 40 character uh, uh, tagline and call to action and then hope that they click that to get to the actual advertisement. Now you'll be able to put up a headline and an actual advertisement. Not only that, but at one point in time, or uh, before now, we was not in China. Gems didn't work in China. Well, guess what? They work now. You know, you can actually advertise. So we actually going to start. Now we're going to open up the Asian market. Okay. We're going to be on Forbes. How, how big is that? So that means think about the quality of that lead. If a person is in the Forbes app, that's a different type of reader, user. You know, if that's what, if that's what they're into and that's what they like, then you know what? That's a higher end lead, I would feel, that will come in and be interested in my business. So if that's the type of lead that joined my business, yes, that's a quality lead. On top of that, okay, we have a now you have a, a, a guaranteed amount of impressions that you get a month with your gems. What that mean? That means that we that royalty is guaranteeing that you're going to get a certain amount of eyeballs per month. Guess what? They're not raising the price at all. Now, let me rephrase that. They're not raising the price to existing customers. So if that means if you get in now, you're going to get in at the price that, the, that it already is, that it's been at, and you're not going to pay a penny more when the price goes up because the price is going up. So after December, when this all goes into effect, price is going up. But if you get in now before the price goes up, then you don't pay a penny more than what a gym is already is, $25. Can you advertise on Facebook right now for $25? At one point in time, you could. They used to call it boosting the post. They took it away. You're not going to be able to. And it's not for a month. And, it's not, and that's not all month either. That was like one time, 25 bucks Done. Now you pay $25. Is this going to be hard to sell to a customer? Is that going to be hard? Also, if you used to be in royalty, you need to reactivate your gems. Get a hold of me, 619-306-9453. Call me. Okay, because there's about to be a big wave. Think about it. Last year or two years ago when royalty first introduced the gym it caused a frenzy and in and in, in 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 shook up the industry it was a it was a, it was a game shaker and everybody was rushing to make their first platform their own weekend software and all this stuff but more importantly it was the 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 the, 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 the buzz and that buzz was so high and strong i got 126 sales in one month that was my biggest month Okay, my phone used to ring off the hook all day, all day, all all day, every day. That I had to get help from my girlfriend and my son to help me answer the phones. No lie. I predict.
that this is going to be that all over again. I predict that this is exactly what we're, where we're headed for. And this is what we're about to see after December 6th when all those fly-by-night beacon companies are going to go to the wayside. Most of them. Some will be able to weather the storm maybe if they got the, the money and know-how and the due diligence to do so. But I don't see most being able to handle it. Because even this, this is costing royalty millions, not thousands, millions. So in order to even keep up, they're going to have to spend millions. And while they're trying to catch up, we're already going to be so far ahead. People are going to be coming to royalty by the droves. Some of you looking at this video right now are going to be calling and coming back to royalty by the droves. So if you used to be in royalty, if you got a gym on your dresser, if you got, you know, call, reactivate, get a hold of your upline, get back in why you can or not why you can but why the price is still low because you're going to be sitting like this <laughs> when you're sitting there with gyms for 25 dollars and you're getting a certain amount of impressions in a month of 500 impressions a thousand impressions whatever royalty you want to bless us with you're getting out a month and you're advertising on all the major networks oh my god we'd be one of the people that had multiple gyms three gyms six gyms ten gyms Let's say you got 500 impressions for each gym. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Do you see where I'm going with this? That's all I got for you today, all right? If you get it, you understand where I'm going with this, then hit the link below. Get money like a boss.com because it is about to get serious. I told you guys last year, go with the tech company, not the MLM company. If you just chase the money, money runs out. You know, go with the one with the cloud. Go with the one that, that's the innovator, not the one that everyone's duplicating. Because guess what? All the duplicators are now trying to see what royalty's going to do and see if they can duplicate that. But unfortunately, you're going to need millions this time to duplicate. It ain't going to be just buying a beacon from, from China and slapping a stick on it. We are we done with that. That's over with. You ain't building the whole business around a beacon. No more. That's over with. Okay? And I'm so happy we came to this place. Because now, only the strong going to survive. Rightfully so. Because so many people had so much to say last year. And I told everybody, just wait. Just wait. That's why I delete no comments. We're going back to those comments. That was all on my YouTube. All those trolls. I said, just wait. I said, give it six months. Give it a year. We'll revisit. Y'all want to revisit? We got to do it yourself, Joe at Y'all want to revisit? Where's some of you? Where's some of you? Where's some, where's some of the competition? All right, all right, we stay humble. We stay humble. All right. Well, it's just hard, man. Because like I said, I remember last year. Like I said, I took a real bashing on why I stay with royalty. You know, everybody's like, hey, come on, with all this money, with all that downline you have, you would have went someplace else, you would have made so much more. It ain't about the money. It ain't about the money. And I'm glad I made the right decision. With that being said, hit the link below, get money like a boss.com or call me, 619-306-9453, and we get you started. All right, appreciate your time. If you haven't already done so, smash that subscribe button. All right, peace.